One of the biggest problems people have in business and in career life is that they can't sell themselves. So I'm here in central London in Leicester Square and I'm going to be stopping people in the streets and asking them if they'd like to apply for a position in my company. Let's see if someone's got what it takes and can they sell themselves in a real life, on the spot, job interview. Let's go. If you worked for me and you saw me moving a dead body, what do you do? I'll help you with a dead body. Really? You're taking the piss. Hello. Hi, nice Samuel. to meet you. Senia, good nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How you doing, man? Good, yourself? Good. My name's Monique. Good to meet you. You too. So you're looking for a job? Tell me about yourself. Well, I'm a law student. Oops, sorry, just knocking, knocking over Knocking my family over and everything. <laughs> what was it about my job interview sign that made you stop by and want a job interview? I thought, why not? Let's do it. We've got a property company. We've got an education company. And the biggest thing that I want help with is customer service. What's your name? Max. I already work in customer service, so I already oh, have the experience. Oh, that's good. Well, I, so I call it customer happiness because customer service, I say, is what Scottish Power do. No one has the life experience I have. No one. Not even you. Um, I'm also incredibly, I call it the three E's, energetic, empathetic, and energised. What's the difference between energised and energetic? Uh, oh, sorry, I've forgotten one of the E's. <laughs> um, and it's pretty similar yeah. there. This is your big life lesson, <laughs> the big three E's that you run your life by and you don't remember what one of the E's are. Come on, what's the third E? And, uh, uh, oh, it's escaping me in this moment, but that let you down, bro? I'll, I'll message you on Instagram later, don't <laughs> worry. With that third E. I like it, man. I appreciate your time. I've got a CV, I'll, I'll yeah, keep good. with you. All right, my Ooh. friend. You broke my family picture. So, oh my God. That's my picture of my wife oh and kids. Oh my God. I'm so sorry, sorry, Samuel. I've got big feet. That is the most precious oh thing to God. me in the world and you broke it and you didn't remember the third E either. I'm so sorry, Samuel. That's, that, that's okay. That's okay. Oh my God. All right. Thank you so much. Sorry, mate. Oh my God. I've got such big feet. I come to get your job. You want a job? Yes. So why should I hire you? Because I've been good salesman. Before. You've been salesman? Yes. Make me a sale. Sell me those headphones. I want to see how good you can sell. You want headphones? I want you to sell them to me. This is headphones. You want headphones? Buy it. That's the worst sales pitch I've ever seen in my entire life. Do you want headphones? You need the headphones. This is the headphones. Dude, that's a terrible sales pitch. You're not even selling, you didn't give me one benefit. You no. didn't tell me anything about them good, you didn't ask me any questions, you just said, this is headphone, you buy headphone. No, do you want the headphone? No, is... I did want them, but you sold too terribly, now I don't want them. Okay. When the customer is trusting you, after that, sell it. You can sell it. First you can let the customer be trusting you. Sorry, what were you saying? First of all, you can let the customer he trusting you. When he's yeah. trusting you, after that you can tell him about the price and you sell him. Okay. How much do you want to get paid? How much is more is better. Is that I don't have limit. So how much would you like to get paid? The year? Yes. 100,000? 100,000. Yes. For a customer service role. You're Doesn't taking a piss. No, 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 mate. No. You're taking a piss. <laughs> I'm a law student yeah. and I want to go into property law. So that's the main thing that attracted me and wanted me to apply is that I'm already okay. on the route in terms of property. The thing is you keep saying like you're young. You don't look that young to me. Please. How old are you? 23. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you're not that young. Not that young, but still quite young. You see this job as a stepping stone? Not necessarily. You see, but working it, for my company is, is a stepping stone to where it, you want to go. It is. It's all about you. No. Not about the company, not about the customer, it's all about you. <laughs> It is a stepping stone because you have to start somewhere. Damn. So you don't know where you're gonna, you really just where said you're that gonna be. In a job interview, you really just said this is a stepping stone. <laughs> Damn! You're very self-centered, you know. No, not me. Never. <laughs> Alright, off you go. Alright, who's next? Hello, hello. What's your name? My name's Ruben Blake, bro. I'm in the British Army. I command a small team of men through sort of hard, difficult times. So wow. uh, naturally leadership and commanding potential. It's all about face-to-face -face working with people. This, um, is on, this is over online, over the computer? Well, I'm very good online as well. And online, I think there's a lot of similarities actually that come over. This is like email. Okay. I did a politics uh, degree 
uh, as well. Which How much did you spend on your politics degree? £60,000. That was a waste of money. Oh, 100% I agree with you. Uh, <laughs> one of my skills was I managed to do my dissertation in seven days. Quick so you left it to the very last minute. Is that how you do life and business? You just it's leave not... things till the last minute? So I, I, I don't leave it to the last minute in life. It's about taking control. I think you and, talk and too and much. Okay. I think you need to just enjoy some quiet. The, the soundscape of London. I do struggle with silence. Yeah, <laughs> we need just a little bit of silence. How long do you want to enjoy the silence, as it were? I'm enjoying it. You're loving it. So you'd be okay with like getting people coffees and things like that? Oh, 100%. Great. You can know, I get a coffee? A, yeah. Yeah, I can, I can go you. for a run. I'll go do that. I'll be back. I'll see you in a minute. Two days. I'm going to go get him a coffee. Right. I like him. He's smart, sophisticated. He's been in the army. He's disciplined. Very good. Like him. How's it going? I'm very good. Nice to meet you. So you're yeah. looking for a job? Yes, absolutely. Question for you. If you worked for me, yeah and you saw me one day yeah. moving a dead body, what do you do? I'll help you with the dead body. <laughs> really? Yeah. So you're prepared yeah. to break the law? Now and now, unashamed <laughs> criminal? Absolutely, absolutely. And why are you looking for a normal job with me? Yes, that, that is like, I don't have a team or like uh, or friends where it's like powerful. Do you powerful, think that might be because people. you are a criminal? This is a picture of my beautiful family. I knew. Do you think my wife is pretty? Very well. Would you have sex with her? Never. No. Never. I'd like to see you smash, smash the uh, photo frame on the floor hard. I'm so sorry about that. I can't. You can't? No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Be gone. Be gone. Thank you. Be gone. Can't follow simple instructions. He can move a dead body but can't smash glass. Where is my coffee? That's what I want to know. Where's my coffee? Oh, he's here! Hello. Ruben is back! <laughs> and he got three... Oh, it's what a, happened? Bit of a wait. Well, I, I forgot to ask you specifically what type of coffee you want, so I went for a variety. Oh! That was my bad. Oh, my goodness! <laughs> so, I went for a medium cappuccino, a latte, a black coffee... Which one's the I latte? And a caramel waffle latte. Which one's the... <laughs> well, right, here's what we need to do, right? <laughs> Give me the latte, okay. and I want to see you sell the other three. Sell the other three? Yeah. Just to see if you can sell one of the others to one of those guys over there. All right then. So, someone over there? Yeah. Or anyone? Three days. Hello, guys. Hello. Hello. Do any of you like black coffee? There's millions and millions of people, specifically in London, and today I want to be interviewing people back to back to back to back. I'm scared to So the question oh is, why should I hire you over somebody else? Um, trustworthy, I'm honest. I would expect you to be those things. Okay. You're naming Something, basic okay. things that everybody would expect. You don't like black coffee? No. no. Okay, how about I do this? Yeah. So, you buy it off me now, and then I can maybe sweeten the deal, give you something else for it as well. What's your proudest moment you've ever had, professionally? I haven't got there yet. You've never done anything professionally that you think I'm proud of that. And you're how old? I'm 33. Jesus had done so much by the age of 33. <laughs> There's so many things that I'm proud of. One, I'm proud to be a go-getter. I'm proud to be here talking that's not to a you. Thing, no, that's not a thing. No? You can't be proud of doing an interview that you probably will never get the job of. I think you should interview me. Okay. What brings you to Samuel Lee's interview today, Samuel? Looking for good people to hire. I thought, what better place than central London? I thought the location could be better. I don't know how you feel about the location. Perhaps Chinatown would have been better? Maybe. For me, it's about evolving constantly. And if I'm not Are you told, strong? I'm a very strong individual. Are you physically strong? Yes, I am. Armour something. Oh my god! Ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Ready and go. So this black coffee that I just got from hey, McDonald's hey. there. Is that something I can interest you in at all? Hello, Mom. Can I proposition you with something a bit strange? Do you have a good vocabulary? Of course I do. Can you even spell vocabulary? Yes, I can. Go on. V O C A B U R O B. Oh, Wait! You can't spell I it. I can't. I don't see any aggression. Okay. Passion. Passion. Fire. Fuel. Where is it? I want you to smash that photo on the floor. Smash it? Yeah, on the floor. That was my family. What do you think about the saying, 
The customer is always right. The customer is sometimes always right, but not I can you sometimes always... be always something? No. This, that can't... was a sitting on the fence answer. It'll okay. be like a six months project. Six me. months, suck all the energy, suck all the resources, yeah, big fat on. stepping stone, and then go do something bigger and better. Correct. Sounds awful. No one in London seems to like black coffee. I'm from mid Wales, so how people get through their day where I am. Yeah, but how much would you like to be making? Over 100 mil. Over 100 mil. 100 mil? Yeah, I'd, 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 like, I don't think it's about. No, we can't, we, we can't afford that. Hey! Um, yeah. Alright, good. I look forward to. Uh, <laughs> Thank you so I'll be in touch, okay? Thank, Thank you. you. Very much. We'll take your details. It weren't enough, or was it enough? Well, you it tell was, me. I think it was great. But, uh, you think it was, well, there we go. You should yeah, be proud of yourself. I am. <laughs> well done. Thanks a we'll lot. Be in touch. Yeah. But I would not want to have you as a member of staff. But I would. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs>